Today we are in Bandung. In this video we're going to visit markets. It's literally like a maze in here. We're going to go to a mosque. We're going to meet a lot of local people, including the famous YouTuber Raman Zed. Stay tuned for later in the video to see how that goes down. What just happened? And also explore the city by a tour bus. Such a relaxing tour around the city. Say hi everybody! <laughs> Okay, <laughs> let's officially get into this video. Good morning guys, we are just waiting for our taxi right now and we're gonna get dropped off in the city center. We have absolutely no plans for today, so I'm excited what today brings. When you find a hole in the traffic, you have to take it. <laughs> We just came across a really nice looking and well-maintained building that's called Jidong Sate. And it's built in a Dutch colonial style and it dates back to the 1920s. It's currently being used by the West Java government. Our first impressions of Bangdong is that it's a very green city. Was not expecting that actually. We're now walking down this beautiful sidewalk and as you can see, it's just fully covered in trees. Also outside the city, it is quite mountainous and very green. Yeah, it's a really beautiful city so far. <gasps> We're walking down this really lovely street and there's some cafes, restaurants and actually some really nice villas. What I am most surprised about is that it's actually really walkable, which is not very usual for Asian cities. Hello, we have a little friend. How are you? You want to say hello? Can you say hello? Say hello. Hello. <laughs> hello. Hello. Say subscribe. 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 <laughs> Your mum? Yep, okay. <laughs> Very cute. Hello, good morning. Hello, hello. Just come across some food stalls here. So we're gonna have a look at what they're making. Oh my gosh, fried banana. It actually reminds me of the Brazilian ones that you get if you go to like a Brazilian restaurant. They look absolutely delicious. It smells really good here. Some type of, oh, it looks like, oh like a wonton. It's so good. Oh yeah, it's delicious. It's very crispy. Yum. We have nasi goreng and some satay. Salamat tingal. I wish that you could smell what we're smelling right now. Absolutely delicious. Notice that there are so many large colonial white buildings and they're really pretty to look at. There are also a number of really large churches. Hi! This is so cool. Just the way the houses are right along the river. Some of the houses almost look like they're falling apart a bit and almost look like they're collapsing into the river. I can see that there's a path underneath the building so we're gonna go see if we can walk along the river. Don't really know where we're going. We can see some dark alleyway over there, so let's see where it leads to. Okay then. Ding. I don't know where this leads to. Okay. Looks like there's a prayer room here. Okay, we've made it to the path that we saw from the bridge and I think we're gonna go for a little walk. It's currently prayer time right now, so we can hear all the mosques in the city just reciting the call to prayer. Sounds so cool. Do we go straight? I think maybe down here. Yeah. Salamat <laughs> Tengal. Hello, Salamat <laughs> Tengal. This way? Okay. Yeah, I think there's a dead end over there. Salamat Tengal. Salamat Tengal. So currently we're just walking along a small alleyway. The houses are so narrow. People are really friendly, so they don't seem to mind us walking here, which is good. I think there's a school here. It's a cute little square. It's cute how there's like a whole little community just along the river. <laughs> oh my God, they just said. <laughs> We just reached another small alleyway. Oh, this looks so cool here. 
There's so many cute children here. Hi. Hello. This way. This way. Hi. Hello. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. <laughs> so interesting to see how people are living along here. Hello. Hello. Oh, that looks so good. Oh, wow. I think they're making prawn crackers or something like that, and it smells so good. Oh my god, it's so cool just how there's all these little narrow alleyways. There's a little shop, shop here. That's so cute. Oh my god. Hello. Salamat Tingal. Hello. So along a lot of these really narrow alleyways, there's actually a lot of birds in bird cages. So you can hear all the birds. Oh, you can hear them now. <laughs> That's a very cute one up there. All the alleyways are semi-covered, so I wonder what would happen in the rainy season. I think a lot of people are cooking lunch right now because it smells delicious around here. Oh, dead end. Let's go this way. There are small mosques in between a lot of the houses. Wow, it's so beautiful through here. People actually have really gorgeous gardens. Check this out. Look at these wall hanging pots here. It's so beautiful. People really seem to take pride of their front doors and the garden areas. It's so nice here. It's actually kind of like a tranquil, peaceful area in the middle of the city. <laughs> Why is this rooster so tall? It looks like a model. Like, its legs are massive. It's so long. I'm just, what? Yeah, but he looks mostly in tone. Looks like he's been working out. It's legs. It looks like it needs to have arms. <laughs> right? Its legs are so long. I don't think I've ever seen a rooster with legs that long. I can see a horse down here. Yeah, I feel like we're in a very local area. Right Hello. Now. Hello. I was not expecting to find this in the middle of a big city. Hello. How are you? Hello. And the best thing about coming to the local areas is that you get to meet all the people. And I have to say, they've just been so super friendly. Check this out. Oh, they're so cute. Hello. Hi. 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 The kids here are so cute. So many cool artworks on all of the walls. It looks really nice. So colorful. Just been walking around all the really narrow alleyways along the river. And just probably another 100 meters up from the river, we came to this street called Braca Street. And it looks really lively. Lots of cars, lots of shops, lots of restaurants, lots of cafes. So I reckon here tonight it's going to get really busy. They have so many shops selling beautiful pieces of art along the street and I keep taking photos of them to get inspiration for my DP art course. We've just spotted these really cute old style buses and it's actually called Bangdong Tour on Bus. So we're going to go and have a look and see if we can grab tickets and see if we can jump on one of these little bus tours. It is a beautiful green city. You really get to appreciate here from the bus how many trees they actually have here in the city. So really enjoying this ride. And at the moment, we're the only three on the bus, so we are basically getting a private tour. Did you know Bandung is known as the Paris of Indonesia? I did not know that. And this is apparently because of all the European settlers that came here in the past. I actually can't believe how many colonial style buildings they have here in the city. So they're all painted white and they look really amazing. I've loved this tour so much. It's been so relaxing. It's so nice with the lovely breeze and just looking out at the city. It's been really nice. Thank you so much. That was really, really good. Thank you. Thank you so much for We've just stopped in at a local Indonesian coffee shop and we're so excited to try some traditional Java coffee. Mm. 
So we're going to head out after here and we're going to head over to quite a large mosque actually. We went past it on the little bus so we were really curious to go and have a look. I feel like we've probably missed a load of things here in Bangdong so if you are a local and you're watching our video pop in the comments some suggestions on things that we could do here. Things that are outside of the city maybe that you think that we should go and explore. Pop it in the comments because we'll definitely be coming back here. I don't understand how that works every time. Like we just crossed like five lanes and we didn't get hit. The Masjid Raya Bandung or the Great Mosque of Bandung was completed in 2003. It can house up to 13,000 people and it has two really tall minarets that's 81 meters tall. There's also two golden domes on each side of the mosque. So pretty! What's your name? Ayu. Ayu? Nice to meet you. So I'm Ella. Are you from Bandung? Yeah. Yeah? I'm from Australia. Good day, bye. I think I had about six people ask me for a photo, so very cute, got to meet some new people. We have just arrived at Pasaburu Market and it is the biggest market in Bandung, so we're excited to explore it. So far I can see lots of beautiful dresses and many, many clothes shops, so let's see if we can get any bargains. This is such a colourful market. Look at these dresses, they're so pretty. I have no idea how we're gonna exit this place. We just took so many turns and my navigational skills are not the best, so I'm not sure how we are gonna exit this place. It's literally like a maze in here. Oh my gosh, there's a level below as well. There was also a top level too. That's kind of nice for daddy. Hello, me. Hello. Hi. Could I see um, that? Yeah, all. Yeah, yeah, I think that's easier. Which one? I don't know, they all look. And this one? Oh my god, this one. So <gasps> yeah, that's so pretty. How much for each one? $4.50. 80000 <laughs> 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 Oh my gosh, how can, you how can you say. How can you bargain with that smile? My bargaining yeah, is that not. That's horrible at heckling. I mean, normally I'm okay. I'm buying a scarf for my best friend. That's so pretty. Yes, yes, this one, this one, yes. Hey, terima kasih. Yeah. Okay, so I got two scarves and they're really, really pretty. And even though I didn't bargain or haggle very much, I still think it's a bargain. That's good. <laughs> That marketplace was so cool. It was huge. Like we probably only saw maybe, I don't know, 5% of it. There's definitely a lot more to explore in there, but we just don't have enough space in our luggage to buy any more things. What's your name? Nisa. So Nisa and Bella. Yeah. yeah. So my name's Ella and from Australia. How old are you? You are blessed. Uh, 12? Yeah, okay, yeah. I think 12. <laughs> Me? 1? One. 6. 16. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I love talking to like the local people here. They are just so cute. I don't know how many times I've said it, but they are so cute. That is one of the biggest dilemmas when we're traveling. We just can't fit all this stuff in our suitcase. <laughs> but it's so tempting when you see all these beautiful things. It's really hard not to shop up a storm. Our little friends are back. They've been following us around the streets here. They want to talk to Ella. They're teaching her some Indonesian at the moment. Some bahasa. <laughs> so cute. Hello. <laughs> bye bye. We just spotted this street and it is full of people in costumes. Oh my gosh, why is that so freaky? Very interesting. Okay, I'm interrupting a little bit too much, we're gonna have to pay. <laughs> okay. okay, some of the costumes are a little creepy, not gonna lie. Oh my gosh! Oh. <laughs> <laughs>
Okay, but that's a very interesting street. Braga Street is the most famous street here in Bangdong and it dates back to the 1920s. It's definitely the social hub of Bangdong. You can see over here we actually have an art cafe and yeah, they definitely have a lot of art shops along here as well. This street is so nice. They have so many cafes and restaurants. They also have a large shopping mall. It looks so beautiful at night with all the different lights. So a guy just came over and he said he wants to make a TikTok video and I was like, what's the TikTok video about? and something to do with him giving me flowers. Not sure, we just said yes because we're very, very curious at this point. You feel sit down. Sit here? Yeah, sit here. Okay, so he's doing like some stage giving me flowers thing. Yeah, we just found out that Raman said he has 2 million subscribers, so yes. very impressive. Don't uh, forget to subscribe this YouTube, yeah? What's your name the YouTube? Uh, Living the Joe Live. Living the Joe yeah. and this the name of Raman Z. Yeah, YouTube. Raman Z. Can I take a picture with you? Okay, yeah, sure. What just happened? So I ended up getting flowers and the guy that was giving me the flowers had 2 million subscribers on YouTube. That was very random, but I, I just had so much fun. What the heck? Oh my god, like I don't even know how to react to that. That was one crazy and unexpected day. We hope that you had just as much fun as we did. That's it for this video. See you next time on Living, Living the, the Joe, Joe Life. Life. I just can't do it with how cute and gorgeous these kids are here. They're just melting my heart. I want to take them all home. Me too. Oh wait, that sounds a little kidnappy. <laughs> Good. <laughs>